Hello, hello. Hello, Hi, hello. Good evening. Hey, hello. good evening, Jonathan. Hello, Nubia. Good evening. Hello. Hello, hello, Lisbeth. Welcome. Hello, Norma Elizabeth. Hello, Jocelyn. Hello. hello, Maria Elizabeth. Hello, George hello. Alberto. Hi, teacher. Hi, good evening. Hello, good evening. hello, Yancy. Hello, Nelson. Hello, Josia. Hello, Jonathan. Hello, Lisbeth. Welcome, welcome. Are you ready? Yes. Yes, I do. I'm ready for the action. All right, ready for action like Jesse Jackson. Welcome, welcome. I hope that everybody had an excellent Thursday. Today is the last day of class for this week. Tomorrow we will not have class, so you can relax at home and do your thing and study English <laughs> in your free time. <laughs> All right, let's get started, guys. Uh, who can tell me what topics or what uh, vocabulary or grammar do you remember about yesterday's class? What can you tell me? Uh, we was talking about present continuous and uh -huh. practice some examples. That is correct, right? So in this case, we say we were. We were, exactly. Practicing, very good. We were practicing. Okay, good, good, that's right. Can you give me some examples of um, the present continuous questions that you remember from yesterday's class? What are you doing in this moment? Very good. Jonathan, what are you doing right now? All right. What are you doing right now? I'll go ahead, Jonathan Josue. Ask Jocelyn, what are you doing right now? Uh, Jocelyn, what are you doing right now? I'm studying English. Excellent. Uh, Jocelyn, ask uh, Jonathan a question with the present continuous. Um, what are you doing this morning? This morning? Uh, in that case, uh, that's simple past. Um, what, exactly. what did you do? This morning, what did you do this morning? Teacher, uh, what what did you what did you do this morning? Right. That is correct. What did you do this okay. morning? And you can say, I went to the gym. What did you do this morning? I went to the gym. But in this case, it's not present continuous. It is okay. simple past. Simple, simple past. Simple past. Correct. Okay. Um, what are you doing right now so the same question in this moment i'm studying english in mm -hmm. my class that's right that's right uh there are different ways or different things that you can ask uh, for example um if you say for example estás aprendiendo inglés are are you learning english very good. Are you learning learning English? Are you learning English? Correct. And the response is yes. I am learning oh, English. No. No, this is a yes no answer. It's a ah, close. Yes, yes, yes. yes uh, no. I'm not. All right. Or you could say, is your mom cooking? 
right now? Is your mom cooking right now? What do you respond? What do you respond? Uh, yes, she is. Yes, she is, or no, no she, she is. isn't. Um, are we practicing the present continuous right now? What do you respond? Yes, we are, or no, we aren't. Yes, we are, or no, we aren't. Good. Right? Or you can say, are they playing soccer? What is your response? Yes, they are, or no, they aren't. Yes, they are, or no, they aren't. Good. Another question, who can give me another example? Teacher, y siempre son cerradas las respuestas a todas las preguntas en el presente. If you ask the question with the be verb, are, is, yes. But if you ask, for example, what, W H question where correct W H questions what is your dad doing right now? What is your dad doing right now? Uh, you can say he is uh, watching the the news. He is watching the news. All right, oh, I eat. there is not yes, no questions, or uh, where are you going? Where are you going? A donde vas? You say, I am going to sleep. <laughs> All right, oh, con quien estas hablando? Who? Are you talking talking to? ¿Con quién estás hablando? Who are you talking to? I am talking to my teacher. Okay. Or you can say, ¿Qué estás comiendo? What are you eating? Just a second. I'm going to share with you the sentences. Did everybody receive the examples? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. I'm going to share them with you in the uh, WhatsApp chat. All right, there you go. Or uh, another example could be, eh, ¿Qué estás escuchando? What? What? What are you listening? Are you listening? What are you listening to? And you can say, I am listening to a podcast for him i am listening to a podcast um what where when okay when are you how did i say the future 
El con el when no se puede. What, where, when. Ok. Eh, are you reading a book? What's the response? Um, yes, I am. Or? No. No, I am not. I'm not. No, I'm not. Right? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Uh, is your brother playing video games? Is your brother playing video games? Yes, he is. Or no, he isn't. Is your sister talking on the phone? Yes, she is. Or no, she isn't. Right? All right, these are just a, a couple of examples of WH questions and examples of uh, closed questions, yes, no questions. Uh, let me have two, uh, two uh, volunteers. Two volunteers. Can I try, teacher? Me, teacher. Okay. Uh, let me have uh, Jocelyn and Can I try? and Jonathan. Okay, good. Uh, Jonathan, I want you to ask the questions and Jocelyn respond to the questions. Okay. Um, are you learning English? Yes, I am. Uh, let me check. What is your mom doing right now? My mom is cooking right now. She is cooking. Exactly. Uh, what are you listening to? I'm listening my English class. I'm listening my English class or I'm listening to my English class. I listening to my English class. I listening to or I'm listening to. I listening to. Uh, look, look at my lips. I'm I'm, I'm I'm listening to my English class. Yes. Continue. Uh, are you paying attention attention right now? Yes, I am. Uh, do you have a brother? Yes, I have brothers uh, what what is your brother doing right now uh, he is watching television okay and where uh, where are you living right now I'm living in Ciudad Arce right now who are you talking to Who am I talking? Who are you talking to? I'm talking with you. Correct. Okay. Uh, is you playing soccer right now? No, I am not. 
are you? I'm sorry. Are you, are you playing soccer right now? I'm sorry. Uh, are you listening to music in this moment? No, I am not listening to music. Okay. Use that teacher. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, now we're going to change roles. We're going to have Jocelyn is going to ask the questions and then Jonathan is going to respond. Okay. Are you learning English? Uh, yes, in this moment. Uh, yes, I am. <laughs> Okay. Is your mom cooking right now? No, she isn't. Okay. Uh, are you practicing English right now? Uh, yes, I am. Okay. What is your dad doing right now? Actually, I don't have a father, but I can invent uh, my father, my father is uh, listen listening to music right now. Uh, we have one father. My father, my God. father. God is our father in heaven. Ah, uh, exactly. I'm sorry. We have, my... one, we have one heavenly father. Yes. Um. What are you doing right now? In this moment, I'm talking with you and I'm listening my class, my English class. I am okay. listening my English class or I am listening to my English class? I'm sorry, my mistake. I, I'm listening to my English class. Uh -huh. okay. I'm sorry. Are you reading a book? Uh, no, I am not. Okay. Um, that's all. Okay, that's okay. Uh, awesome. Good work. Good pronunciation. Remember, it takes practice. Uh, it takes time. It's a development. Okay, Jocelyn, select somebody. Jonathan, select somebody. Uh, Norma. Elizabeth Lizano. Lizano, ask the question. Okay. And okay. Jenny, Carolina. Carolina, respond to the question. Carolina, are you learning English? I don't listen. I don't listen or I can't hear you. I can't hear you. That's right. We say, I can't hear you. I can't hear you. Are you learning English? Yes, I am. Is your mom cooking right now? Repeat, please. Is your mom cooking right now? No. She is not. Okay. Uh, are they playing soccer? No, I'm not. No, no. What they... is that going? Uh, one moment, Elizabeth. Uh, the question is, are they are playing they... soccer? Mm -hmm. They. So you respond, no. They aren't. What's your dad going right now? What's your dad going right now? Let me put it. Repeat, repeat. Do you have Do you have a headset? Do you have speakers? No? Okay. All right. We're going to change partners because uh, Jenny has problems hearing. Thank you, Jenny. Uh, Norma ask Jose Luis. Jose Luis respond. Okay. okay. 
Jose Luis, yeah. are you learning English? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Is your mom is your mom cooking right now? Uh, yes, yes. Yes. She is. Are they playing soccer? In my free time I play soccer. Where are you going? Como? Where are you going? Eh, no puede, puede responder las, las respuestas que yo les di. Las mismas respuestas que yo les di. La pregunta es, where are you going? I am going to sleep. Las preguntas están en el WhatsApp. If you have WhatsApp, están en el WhatsApp. Y también están en el Zoom. No, no, no. Where are you going? Where are you going? Uh, where are you going? I, I play with my laptop. Uh, who are you talking to? Uh, I talking uh, with, with Jenny. I talking or I'm uh, talking? I, I look, 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 look. I'm, I'm, I'm. Tiene que cerrar los labios. I'm, como que se está diciendo. I'm, 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 I'm talking with my teacher. Okay. Ruben Santos, number one. Yeah. Number one. Eh, hago yo las preguntas ahora. Yes, now uh, change the roles. José Luis, ask the questions. And Norma Elizabeth, respond to the questions. Okay, Norma. Okay. Can you hear me? Eh, Norma, de su, Norma, de su lado se escucha bien fuerte la tele. Si le puede bajar un poquito, sería genial. Voy a desconectar el auricular mejor. <laughs> ok, ok. Yes, I am. Ok, are you learning English? Yes, I am. Is your mom cooking right now? No, she isn't. Are you practice the present continue right, right now? Yes, we are. Are you playing soccer? Yes, yes, they are. Yes, I practice. Is watching the new, watching the new? Uh, repeat, 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 Jose Luis. Is watching the new. Mm, no. Is watching the news. Yes. Así puse. What is your dad going right now? The... Esa es la respuesta. Uh -huh. uh, ok, eso no. Are you reading a book? Uh, no, la pregunta es: What is uh -huh. your dad doing right now? La respuesta es: He is watching the news. Ah, uh, pues thank you. <laughs> Why, yeah. What is your dad doing right now? Dad. He is he is watching the news. Okay. What are you listening to? No, it's no. Are you reading a book? Okay, no. Yes, I am. Did your brother play video games? Yes, he is. Uh, okay, teacher, I finish. All right, excellent, excellent. Good, okay, now select another partner. Uh, okay, select normal one volunteer, please. Select and somebody. In my case, Mamu. Jonathan Flores. 
Jorge Alberto, no, I can. Jonathan Flores. Hey, thank you. Jorge uh, Alberto. Uh, oh, oh, sorry about that. Um, Jonathan present. Flores already participated. Select somebody different, please. Jose Luis? Jose Luis? Uh, uh, teacher, Jorge Alberto. Jorge Alberto. Hello. Ask questions. Okay. Jorge Alberto. The same, the same are in the chat? Yes, please. Okay, right now I start. Uh, Norma Elizabeth, who did you select? Jose Orellano. I'm sorry? Jose Orellano. Jose Orellana. Jose Enrique Orellana. Ding, 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 ding. Jose Enrique Orellana. Voy a seleccionar otro entonces. Yes, please. Jose Oscar se ve que quiere participar, se lo veo en los ojos. I can see it in your eyes. I can see it in your eyes. All right. Jorge, Jorge Alberto, ask a question. Jose Oscar, respond to the question. Okay. 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 Uh, Jose Oscar, are you not English? Uh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Okay, is your mom cooking right now? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. Excellent. Are we practicing the present continuous right now? Yes, we are. No, we aren't. Are they playing soccer? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. What is your dad doing right now? He's watching the news. What are you doing? I am going to sleep. Who are you talking to? I am talking to my teacher. Excellent. What are you listening to? I am listening to a postcard. Are you reading a book? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is your brother playing video games? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Is your sister talking on the phone? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. I can hear you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Change Thanks. the role. Ask me, please. Okay. In English? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is your mom cooking right now? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. Are we practice the present continuous right now? Yes, we are. No, we aren't. Are they playing soccer? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. What is your dad doing right now? He's watching the news. Where are you going? I'm going to sleep. Who are you going? To? Where are you going? To? I'm not going going. To another place okay anywhere. who are you talking anywhere. to okay <laughs> right there you say i am not going anywhere repeat i am not going anywhere i'm not i am not going, going anywhere. anywhere i am not i am not going anywhere excellent in any... <laughs> where <laughs> i'm going to my room to sleep <laughs> i'm going to my uh -huh. okay Excellent. I'm going to my room to sleep. All right. Stop right there. Stop right there. Good job. Now, vice versa, 
vice versa. George Alberto, ask the questions. Jose Oscar, respond to the question. Okay. Are you learning English? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is your mom cooking right now? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. We are practicing the present continuous right now. Yes, we are. No, we aren't. Are they playing soccer? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. What's your dad doing right now? He is watching the news. Where are you going? I am going to sleep. Who are you talking to? I am talking to my teacher. What what are you Number one. <laughs> what, did, what are you listening to? I am listening to postcards. Okay, stop right there. Stop right there. All right, I see that everybody pretty yeah. much uh, understands the usage of the present continuous. Uh, I know and I understand that this is the first time that you guys uh, maybe see this topic. So I know that it's something that you got to study, something that you have to review, something that you have to uh, practice, right? Um, los animo a que no solo se queden a la práctica de la clase, right? Because if you do that, no va a haber retención, right? To have retention, there has to be practice. For example, for example, eh, when you are listening to the radio, cuando escuchas la radio y repiten la misma canción every day, all the time. Do you remember the song, pasito, pasito, suave, suavecito? Do you remember the song? Yes, I yes. Oh, yeah. man. It, it, there was a time where I was like, stop, stop, you know, because it was like all the time. And then, you know, I was sleeping and I'm like, pasito, pasito. I'm like, stop, stop. Right? It's like a program. So repetition is the key to learn English. Repetition is the key to retain the information, right? So one hour is not enough time, very simple. One hour is not enough time. One hour is like a cookie. Do you know what is a cookie? Galleta. That's right. One hour of English is only like a cookie. You have to program your time and practice more after class, before class, in between class, in the morning, at lunch, in the afternoon listening to music in English, watching TV in English, reading magazines or books in English. Online, you're going to have the world of English available to you. But it takes discipline. Discipline. What is discipline? Discipline. That's right. That's right. When your friends call you, hey, what's up, Jose? Hey, let's go to the party. Let's go to the beach. Let's go over here. And no, I can't. Because right now, I am learning English. When I speak English, let's go to the beach. But right now, my concentration my objective, my goal 
my mission is speak English, learn English. Don't waste your time. Use your time. When somebody say, hey, let's watch El Chavo del Ocho. <clears throat> no. I need to watch a program in English. Okay? okay. Repetition, rep listening, listening, repetition, repetition. It's the only way, guys. All right. I'm going to I'm going to share with you my personal experience. Uh, when I came to El Salvador in 2006, my Spanish was bad. Cuando yo hablaba español, la gente like, ¿qué dijo? Oh, mira qué dijo. What did he say? Yo me crié en un hogar salvadoreño. Yo me crié con mi abuela y mi abuelo. En mi casa, puro español. But what happened? I never practiced it. I didn't practice Spanish. I was at school, English. With my friends, English. Music in English. TV in English. University in English work in English, so I didn't practice English. So what happened? Uh, it came in one ear, boop, came out the other ear. Pero si usted me hace una pregunta, hoy yo hablo español perfectamente. Why? Because I had to practice, right? I was watching Univision. Cuando yo escuchaba las noticias, yo entendía esto. Soy Apango. Univision. Apopa. Univision. That's it. Metrocentro. I was like, I didn't understand. I only understand. Parts, fragments, phrases, but I didn't understand. Why? Because I didn't practice. Pero ahora yo puedo mantener una conversación muy fluida con una persona en español sin ningún problema. Tuve que reaprenderlo. Right? So it takes discipline, guys. It's not easy, but you have to push, push. You have a mission, you have an objective, you have a goal, do it. You can do it. Okay? Now, what I would like for us to do at this moment is we are going to move forward. And we're going to be looking at, I come from a big family. We're going to look and we're going to listen to the audio. Oh, sorry. It's time to take the attendance. Give me one second. When I call your name, please say present. If you see your classmate write something in the chat, please let me know. Alexandra Vasquez. Alexandra Vasquez. Present. Present. Good job. Jocelyn Alcantara. Present. Excellent. Josia Mejia. Present teacher, present. Very good. Jonathan Flores. I'm here. Good. George Morales. Present. Sure. Thank you. Jose Oriana. Present. Thank you. 
Jose Castro. Hello, may I press him? Good. Jose Herrera. Present teacher. Good. Present teacher. Good. Julio Alfaro. Presente. Thank you. Julio Campos. Julio Campos. Ah, él me escribió que estaba trabajando. Okay. Lisbeth Hueso. Present teacher. Thank you. Marcela Losel. Marcela Lucel. Absent, okay. Maria Morataya. Present teacher. Okay. Merin Caranza. Present teacher. Good. Nelson Seron. Nelson Seron. In the past present. Okay. Okay, there it is. Okay, thank you. Norma Hernandez. Norma Hernandez. Norma Callejas. Present. Norma Lizano. Present teacher. Nubia Morales. Present teacher. Oscar Santana. Present teacher. Oscar Ramirez. Present teacher. Reina Perrios. Present. Ronald. Torres. Present the chair. Salvador Gal oh, oh Salvador. Okay. Um Sandra Guadalupe. Sandra Rios. Absent. Sylvia. Melara. Present. Thank you. Susanna Aguilar. Present teacher. Excellent. Yancy Montes. Present. Good. Jenny Ardon. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, good job. So we got Sandra absent. Norma Hernandez absent. Marcela Lucel absent. Julio Campos, he wrote on the chat absent. Okay. All right. Let's get it. Now, what we're going to do is listen to a conversation between 
two people. Uh, who can tell me what do you see in the picture? They have. Jocelyn. Yes. yes. They, they have uh, like a conversation mm -hmm. while they drink something, maybe coffee. Okay. Yes. Okay. All right. Good. Good. Jonathan, what do you think? Uh, the same idea. All right. Could you describe what they are wearing, Jonathan? Uh, the men, uh, there, there are a uh, jacket. Uh, the man is wearing, the man is wearing, is wearing a jacket. Exactly, I'm sorry. The man is wearing a jacket. And I suppose that wearing black shoes, casual, casual, casual shoes. Uh, how do you say morado? Purple, right? Purple. Uh, the man is wearing a uh, purple pants and shirts, shirt white. Okay, remember that we say shirt white? No. In Spanish, we say camisa blanca, shirt white. In English, we say white shirt. Primero, in, in English, es al revés. Eh, primero el adjetivo, después el nombre. White shirt. Okay. All right. Thank you, Jonathan. Another volunteer to describe what is the woman wearing. She's wearing a high blue, blue shirt. Okay. She is wearing a light blue blouse. Okay. Uh, I think I heard somebody say she is wearing high, high, high heels. Okay, correct. And she's wearing blue jeans. She is wearing blue jeans. Perfect. Okay, good, good. Now, what I would like for us to do is we are going to listen to this conversation. We're gonna listen to the conversation and then I would like for you to ask me uh, questions in regards to the pronunciation or the, uh, the verbs. Let me play the audio for you. Sure sound. Sure sound. Okay. Listen, please. If you have a question, please. Hey, from a big a question. Family. Listen to me, Lee and Marcus talk about their family. I come from a big family. How many brothers and sisters do you have, Meili? Actually, I'm an only child. Really? Yeah. Most families in China have only one child nowadays. I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow. Is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller these days. But big families are great because you get lots of birthday presents. How many brothers and sisters do Meili and Marcos have? Type your answers on a discussion box. All right, uh, 
questions in regards to this uh, pronunciation, regards to the meaning of the vocabulary words? Pus? I come from a big family. Teacher, the pronunciation of nowadays. Ah, repeat, repeat. Nowadays. Nowadays. Very good. Nowadays. 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 What, is the, huh? what is the meaning? Uh, nowadays is our in dia. Ah, okay. Our in dia. Nowadays. Another question. Another question. Teacher, uh, read. Which one? Really? Um, read. In uh, Marcos, al final. Uh, not really. A lot of families uh, are smaller these days, but the families are great because you get lots of birthday presents. Uh, I am this uh, big family are great. Oh, I agree. Estoy de acuerdo. I agree. Okay. Gracias. No la veo. I agree. Is in the uh, but big families are agree. Oh, great. Great. great, but big families are great. Ah, okay, okay. Esta, great. Yes. Uh -huh. Great es un sinónimo de excellent. Cuando uno dice great, excellent, fantastic, very good, good job. It's an adjective. Okay, gracias. Good, good. Another question. Repeat, uh, repeat, repeat. Great. 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 Uh, teacher, uh, yeah. the pronunciation typical. Which one? Typical. Oh, typical. typical. Repeat. Typical. 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 Bien similar como tippy toes. Tippy toes. Walk on your tippy toes. Teacher. Huh? La palabra... Walk on your tippy toes. Give me one second, George. Give me one second. Uh, what is the meaning tippy toes? Typical. No. Typical, sí. Wow. Is that typical in Peru? Eso es típico en Peru? That is correct. But tippy toes es cuando te dicen, por ejemplo, cuando vas al mar y la arena está bien caliente. Y te dicen... Camina en tus tippy toes. Camina en las puntitas de tus pies. Puntillas. Ajá, ajá. Las puntillas. That's right. Eso es tippy toes. Okay. O también está pick a boo. Pick a boo. ¿Qué quiere decir pick a boo? Yeah, yeah, correct. 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 Pick a boo. Le dicen a, a, los, a los niños, a los babies. Le dicen, I see. Ice. All right. Another question? Yes, George. Sí. Eh, yo creo que en algunas ocasiones la palabra actually. Actually. Um, actually. La, la ten, sí, la tendemos a, a, a confundir con currently. Uh -huh, currently. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Actually, es como uh, de eh, hecho. Mm -hmm. de, uh, actually, es realmente. Ajá, ajá, uh -huh, uh -huh, correct. Y, y, y currently es uh -huh. actualmente. Correct, correct. 
Por ejemplo, okay. yo digo, actualmente el Bitcoin está subiendo. Currently, Bitcoin is growing. O para decir, actually, por ejemplo, la gente cuando me ve me dicen, eh, ¿Usted es de Panamá? ¿O usted es de República Dominicana? ¿O es colombiano? Because of my, my color. Right? Si yo apago la luz, aquí porque tengo una gran LED light. Pero si apago la luz, <laughs> right? <laughs> like, my, my skin is black, right? So yo, ¿qué les digo? Les digo, actually, I'm 110% Salvadorian blood. Pure breed, raza pura, Salvadorian. All right. Right. Do you understand? Yes. Yes. All right. All right. All right. Uh, another question in regards to this uh, vocabulary? Questions regarding this vocabulary? Okay. I would like for you to practice the conversation with a partner. Practice the conversation with a partner. Ready? Let's go. Practice the conversation with a partner. You will have three minutes. Three minutes. Una foto, pero no sé compartirla. Tichero está por ahí. Yes. ¿Cómo, yes. ¿Cómo, busco, la, cómo busco la conversación? Eh, si la quiere, plataforma? Ahorita, la, ahorita se las puedo compartir en un... Eh, imagen eh, está en la sección 5.6. Vaya, por favor. En el chat. Ok, ok. In WhatsApp, I'm ready. Okay. Okay. How, okay. How many brothers and sisters do you have, maybe? Actually, I am an only son. Really? Yeah. My family in China. Only one side. No. Nowadays. Now uh, nowadays. Uh -huh. Nowadays. Uh, no, I, nowadays. Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. What about what about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow, is that typical in Peru? Peru? Not really. A lot of family are smaller this day, but big families are great because you get lots of birthday presents. También. Okay. Okay. How many brothers and sisters do you have, maybe? Actually, 
I'm an only child. Really? Yeah. Most families in China have only one child nowadays. I didn't I didn't know that. What about you, Marcos? I come from a big family. I have three brothers and two sisters. Wow. Is that typical in Peru? Not really. A lot of families are smaller these days. But big families are great because you get lot, lots of birthday present. Okay, change, okay. How many brothers and sisters do you have mainly? Actually, I am, I'm only child. Really? Yeah, most family in China have only one child. No, Ay, se me olvidó esta palabra. All right, guys, it's already time to go. I got to let you go. I got another class okay, teacher. coming up right now. So remember, tomorrow, no class. We don't have a class tomorrow. So please uh, continue moving forward and practicing. The key is practice, practice, practice. Whatever you can do is one step closer to bringing you to your goal. So that's the key. Right, the weekend is around the corner. Use your time learning and practicing and growing in your English development. All right, guys. Good night. See you tomorrow. Bye. Good night. Bye. Bye. Tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Oh, sorry. 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 <laughs> sorry. See you next Monday. <laughs> See you Monday. <laughs> okay. Good night. Okay. Bye bye. Good night. Have a good time. Enjoy with your family and friends. Bye-bye. Good night.